Matt, Duke is 2-3 and three since Coach K took his leave of absence, and a really bizarre story came out this week that Coach K met with players at his home, banned them from the locker room, and told them they can't wear Duke gear until, quote, they start living up to the standards of the Duke program. What was your reaction to this? Yeah, I think it's almost kind of, it's not, I don't want to call it typical, but it is a motivational point <laughs> that some coaches will use, and it's naturally going to get more attention because it's Duke, and this was the team that was preseason number one, basically unanim almost unanimously preseason number one based on the talent they had returning with Luke Kennard and, and Grayson Allen and then the number one recruiting class coming in. So it's just a, a season full of drama for Duke, all the Grayson Allen stuff, you know, all the freshmen coming in, you know, three of them were hurt. And it's just a team that's kind of been a mess. You know, they have more talent than anybody in the country. This is the most talented roster in the country. Uh, and they just have not put it together. They have not developed chemistry with those Freshman getting healthier and coming into the lineup. You know, Grayson Allen has not been himself on the court. The basketball itself has not been, you know, what we expect from Grayson Allen. You know, Luke Kennard's been their best player, but he's kind of been, uh, had a re reduced role lately. So it's just kind of a total mess. And I'm not surprised that Coach K would kind of take drastic measures here because this is still a team that they get to the tournament, they're as dangerous as anybody. But I, we're beginning to ask the question of whether or not they can actually ever come close to meeting that full potential.